Now, Dooch, tell me if I'm wrong, but I think that birthed the chemistry as opposed to the other way around. Um, and I can't remember entirely. All I know is when I saw that scene, because that speech on the page is really beautiful. And Dreezy and Rebecca wrote that. So you read it and you're like, oh, that's nice. And then you shoot it and your 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 mind is blown because it's just, I mean, it's just like, just, I mean, Caroline, Candace, we always used to make the joke, had chemistry with everybody. And Caroline, as a result, had chemistry with everybody, which is why she dated uh, on the, the Caroline was in a relationship at one point with pretty much everybody on the show. Um, and it worked. Every relationship worked. Right. But that was like, Oh boy. I mean, how do you even, it's so toxic too. I mean, like, again, that little storyline, that little romantic relationship would never get, get through a writer's room today. Cause it's just unbelievably f- up, but boy, <laughs> was it good. The way I remember it uh, was, you know, Rebecca Sonnenschein is a huge friend of mine and an influence, and I love her to death. And I I remember as I got to know Rebecca, I got to know, you know, she was kind of from a small town and she got out of that small town. And I, I think one of the things that she tried to do was in writing Klaus and Caroline was to imply here was a girl from a small town who wanted, you know, the, the greatest temptation to her would be what does the world have to offer? And and again, in the same way, kind of Klaus approached Stefan by tempting him with the thing he couldn't resist. It, it's the same thing with Caroline. He's a master at figuring out what's the thing that you want and how do I dangle that in front of you in order to beguile you. And in, in, in that relationship, I do think, you know, he legitimately had a fondness for her and he legitimately was intrigued by her. And then he's a smooth talker, which is interesting because it's not the guy he was when we met him in the flashbacks when he was abused little kid you know so Mm -hmm. telling the story of how that abused little kid became this guy was always really interesting 